Hey everyone, my name is Soren Iverson. I'm a product designer at Cash App, and today I'm going to show you how you can add Figma files and Fig Jam boards to your Google Calendar. Let's dive in. Here we have the screen that you'll see when you go to create a new Google Calendar invite, except there's a new option here below the Google Meet that has the Figma icon, the ability to add a Fig Jam board, and the ability to add a Figma file. To get this installed on your machine, you'll need a Figma account and Google Chrome. This doesn't work on Safari or Firefox since it's a Chrome extension. Let's go over to the browser. So you can see here on the Chrome web store, we have the Figma plugin, and all I have to do is click add to Chrome. Once I've done that, I'll opt to add the extension. And then it says here that it's been added. If I click on the pin icon here, I can see it without having to click into this extensions menu. If I go to my calendar and try to create a new event, you'll see that nothing has changed. What I need to do is click on the plugin here, go to the login with Figma button, and then if I go to continue with Google, I'll enter my email. And then my password. Once I've done that, I'll do the two-step verification. And then Figma for Chrome will ask if it can access my files, list of files, read files I have access to, and my name, email, and profile image. I'm gonna grant access. And here you can see if I go to create a new event, you'll have the same title, time, ability to add guests to Google Meet, but below that, you'll have the ability to add a FigJam board or a Figma file. If I go to add a Figma file, I can look through my recents and go there, or I can create a brand new one. If I go to FigJam, I can do the same thing. I don't have any FigJams right now, so all I can do is create a new FigJam board for this meeting. This plugin is super helpful if you want to show coworkers a specific Figma file before you jump into a meeting. You can also use it for whiteboarding exercises with interview candidates and much more. Figma only launched this in the last couple weeks, and I'm excited to see how they continue to build it out over time. I hope you now know how to connect Google with Figma so that you can easily add FigJam boards or Figma files directly to your Google Calendar events. And that this tip saves saves you a lot of time as you're creating meetings in the future. If you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe. My name's Soren, and I'll see you in the next video.